All right, so hello and welcome back to another video. Um, today's video is going to be a little bit different. We're in the Emrock today. Um, we've got a day off work, so we're just going to make the most of it, even though it's cold and it's windy. We're probably going to go up the beach for a drive um, and maybe go for a forby, go fish, see what we do. Um, but yeah, today's video is not going to really be about um, fast cars or whatever like I normally do or building anything. It's just going to be a little vlog for the day kind of thing. Um, and as a lot of you know, I've sold my Falcon, uh, the BA is gone. Um, so we're gonna, I might talk a bit also a bit about um, what the plan is for that, because I do have another car coming in a few weeks um, to kind of replace that. Um, but I'm also not sure what we're gonna do with that car, how long it's gonna last. Um, the plan was to kind of keep the car and do like a few things um, it already has a few mods done but at the same time the price I'm getting the car for I can make a bit of money off it so I might also do that um, but yeah we'll talk more about that later in the video um, and yeah for now we'll go over to Craig's house and wake him up because he probably won't be awake even though it's um, 9.30 or 10 o'clock or something um, but yes yeah, so that's going to be today's video and I hope you enjoy it Turn this thing on so I can let it warm up a bit. Um, and when we get to Craig's house, or maybe if it's not too windy, dash cam talking to us. I'll run you through a few little mods I've already done to the car. Um, well, there's actually a few decent mods I've already done. Um, I think um, I haven't uploaded the video yet, but I think I'll upload the other video before this of um, trying to fit 35s to this thing. Um, but if I don't, I'll just make a video for the MROC owners of how I'd fit 35s because it seems to be on the MROC pages that nobody knows how to do anything. So, see how we go. Um, but yeah, that's one little thing. We've done the um, UHF and we got um, Jeff up here. Um, but yeah. All right, so while it's not too windy, this is what it looks like at the moment. Um, we got a 43mm body lift, which is meant to be a 2 inch, but it's actually 43mm. Um, and one and a half inch suspension lift. We're going to a 3 inch suspension lift, so it'll be about 5 inches all around. Um, but at the moment, that's what it is. Now the wind comes back. Hopefully, wind isn't too bad for you. But um, yeah, that's pretty much it for the outside. Oh, we've done the light bar and the bullseye brackets. Um, which just, I've locked it. So you got like these little tupper screws that go into the inside there, and then you just screw these into here. So you actually have to drill into this, which is a bit sketchy, but, oh well, it's done now. Um, so yeah, and we've done our weather shields, bonnet protector, and then for the inside, oh, we have a little aerial over there, because for the inside we've done the UHF, um, and I did something else the other day, and I can't remember what it was. Oh, we're hard by this thing in because um, my speedo's out because of the 35s. Um, I just hard by it in because I got the dash cam um, using the cigarette lighter. Um, and I think that's about it that we've done so far. Um, but it actually goes very well, it has factory diff lock and stuff, so um, yeah been taken a bit off road got a little bit dented up on the bash plate and stuff now all right so we found this um water pond thing in here and i think in the summertime i'm gonna have to come back here because oh that tree's over there is very tight i used to drive up the tree but um you can see there's like swings and stuff into the water so i think summertime we'll be coming back here eh? Yeah, so someone's made like a little ladder and everything up into a little platform. And then they've got a couple of swings going down and into the water. So I think summertime we'll be coming back here. So here's Craig and he wore an 80 series. He got rid of his BA as well. So both the Falcons are gone. Look, he even got the banner as well. So whoever wants the last two hit me up because I want the fucking things gone. Um, and then I'll get more made probably. But yeah, so Craig getting up on that or swapping his BA for an 80 series. Um 
He's also started a little sticker business if you want some custom stickers made or just some weird stickers. He's um, started making stickers. Um, I think, what's your sticker thing on Facebook called? Uh, it's called Boosted Stickers on Facebook. If you want stickers, you can ask him. And then, yeah, we just got Damarok. He, I went up, I didn't video it on my phone because I left it in the car, but um, I went up like his big rock hill yesterday, um, and then, which is just up the road there, so I got him to just drive up it. Um, it was weird though, because I hit the front coming down and he hit the back coming down, but his front was fine. Um, but our bash plate under here is a bit um, dented up. But it works. Um, and yeah. So we got our first bit of sloppy mud. Um, but because I'm first car, I couldn't really video, so I'm going to video Craig go through it. Fuck, it stinks too. He's builded it for the whole way through. I tried to go slow because I didn't know how deep it was. And um, yeah, dropping into that part was a bit sketchy. Um, but yeah, we got through. All right, so while we drive up this freaking hill, um, one, I didn't- um, well, he's on the phone, he said he's packing up soon. Once I know, we're making it out of Stockton. Um, well, we got to find our way out of here first because we can't um, in butt fuck nowhere. So, first of all, what I was saying is we need a GoPro for this kind of stuff because we actually have gone up some pretty cool, good stuff, like the hill we just went up was all right. Um, but also, the hill, videos make hills like not look anywhere near as big as they actually are. Um, and the other thing I want to say is we're kind of fucking like lost at the moment, eh? We're just following this road and seeing where it goes to, and then I'll go into my... <laughs> like Craig just said, we need a spare box car and a fucking camera crew. Um, um, this is going to like a motorbike track at the moment, I think. So we might um, be a little bit stuffed here. But, um, Pretty yeah, cool, we're kind of lost, eh? I'll show you. This. this is the road that we're currently driving through. No diff lock because I can't move. <laughs> well, I got diff lock but it's not turned on. Um, yeah, so this is the road that we're currently driving through. We need like um, yeah, GoPro, better video on for this, I think, um, to make these videos kind of cool. But yeah, so our talk is also. All right, so first of all, definitely not getting up this hill. Um, so now we're gonna try and probably do like a 50 point turn and go back the other way we came. See how we go. Um, the other thing is, where well, Craig's not interrupting us is, um, in a few weeks, I'm not sure how long it is, we're going to be getting another car, um, so we're going to keep doing videos like that, um, but not sure exactly when it's going to be, but these four drive videos are going to keep happening, and I have the car, I might as well use it, um, and yeah, we're trying to find, I'm just trying to walk around these trucks and see which way is going to be the best way to go now, because that way, we're not going up, so it's either go back, or come down this truck, so I'm going to walk down here and make sure there's nothing crazy down the bottom here and I can get back up here if I need to. Okay, so this says no through road private property, but I also look down there, it's like a fucking massive drop and if we go down there, we're definitely not getting back up it. 
um, and it's going to be sketchy going down, especially for Craig with um, no ABS or anything like that. Um, he'll pretty much slide down the whole fucking hill. So, going to have to do like 50 point turning, go back the way we came, um, and then find a different place to go. So, um, Craig got stuck in his hole. I come, when I come through, it kind of dropped down, but he went a little bit too wide and the second wheel dropped into the hole as well and that's how I got stuck. Um, so I set this up, fine out here somewhere and video is trying to pull him out. Shouldn't be too hard, he's not too bogged. Considering I drove through the same hole, he can't be too bogged. I haven't checked if the video actually got it or not, but we pulled him out of the hole and now he's up to here. He kind of can't get out of this, it's too slippery, so he's going to have to go forward through it and see how he goes. We got both come through this way, so he should get out. So I'm not um, exactly sure why what to video and stuff in these 4 videos. I didn't want a video just like a shitty little track so, and it was only like a couple of good things we went through. Um, or I drove through it first so I don't know like the mud holes that we went through. There's a couple of them that are pretty deep. You'll see when I go, when we get out, um, that the whole car is covered in mud because a couple of them were pretty deep and I had to actually like feed it right through. Um, but yeah, I will try and get some of these 4B videos and that better. Hopefully this can gain a follow on for that as well. Um, plus we also still have our car scene stuff um, to get a follow on for that as well. Um, but yeah, so we're finished in the bush there for now. Going to the beach, gonna go pick up a friend and go to the beach um, to drive on Stockton Beach, go fishing and stuff, get some video. Um, and then we might go to the bush again later, I'm not sure, might just cruise home after we go down here, so see how we go. She's a little bit dirty. So is Craig was um, off fishing, we've um, acquired an 80 series. We went and stole his car and um, we're cruising up the beach. So uh, <laughs> this is actually a lot more fun driving this on the beach than it is to drive the fucking Emerald on the beach, I tell you. So even having a manual, it's like, it's harder because you have to change fucking gears trying to get up hills, but it's just more fun.
We got the car back. <laughs> Give Craig back his car. We got ours. See um if we can get this stuck somewhere. All right, we got Craig video from the outside, but I'm just gonna leave it in the sports drive mode and um, see if we can get up here with one hand. Now it's Craig's turn. These um two army jets keep flying over. I'm gonna go up that hill. I can already see in the fucking um, video that it doesn't look that steep, but it's a pretty big hill. Even this one's like decently steep, but that one's heaps steeper. You can see someone got stuck right there. So we're gonna try and get up. <laughs> 